Well, here we are at um, Rotorua, more commonly known Rotorua, but it is Rotorua. A thermal area here in New Zealand, a big tourist spot. Uh, isn't that hot? No, no. I'd rather hop it, I'd rather just lie in it. What if we can lie in it? You can feel the, the wetness from the water and feel a bit of the minerals from the mineral part of it. It is quite nice. What do you think of it, uh, Nibi over there? It's nice. Yeah. I wouldn't mind it though. Why not? I don't know. It's too shallow. Yeah, we can't do bombs in it. And yeah, it wouldn't do some butterfly. It's like a white island. But... It's like my bum. It smells like that. Oh, it looks like the pink and white here says it's like the rocks. Oh, look, Nevi, over there. It's a cat. <laughs> cat wouldn't have lasted very long. Fight its internals. So it's quite exciting around here. Having a bit of a bit of a little adventure. <coughs> oh, there's another big quite a nice muddy looking pool. The other way. So, um, behind me here is the geyser at Fakarea Whatever. As you can see, I moved my big head, and um, yeah, it's banged up quite nicely. Just gonna take my daughter up to the uh, Udupa or cemetery, and we're gonna check out um, my great grandfather Thomas Hunt, who is buried up there. So, we're gonna go and check it out. And what do you think? Get it yeah. all. Yeah. So, what's that behind you? The geyser. The thing is coming off. What's the geyser called? Geyser. Geyser what? <laughs> Guys, a McDizer or oh, look, it's going high now. Exactly. So if you if you remember you remember where we are, over here is a plaque to the Hunts, and here it is. Here, look at this. Here is the Hunt plaque. See, Thomas Hunt. Look at all. Look. Kathleen Thomas, yep. Isaac, William, Eileen, and Hannah, Albert, Tui, Tina, and his brother Isaac. Yep, so mum's, now he's his father, was Thomas. Thomas Hunt. Drink time now. A bit thirsty, the old walking around uh, thermal places. Mm. 
Oh, not <sighs> I had too much bacon in my breakfast this morning. Continental breakfast. Some bacon. Give me the dry horrors. <clears throat> I'm just having a bit of a, a bit of a drink to uh, unwind before we go on our three hour walk in the bush. Love it. And a three hour walk in the bush. You know, pick up those pine trees up there so you get an energy. Good idea. Exactly. I'm coming. Oh, it's steaming my camera up. Oh, Dad, if you if you put your face there, feel my face is all. Stretched. It's a nice, it's all stretched. Is it stretched? Yeah. <laughs> Look yeah. how lovely it is. Yeah, that's pretty bloody hot, man. Damn. Does the air make your face feel stretched? Yeah. Like Look, it. looks a bit stretched. Koro Teo Teo This one's called I reckon No, oh, your face is getting stretched. All stretched. Look at that. Cool, hey, old baths there. Yeah. Are they hot? Are they hot? Yeah, yeah, it's pretty hot. I wonder if I'm allowed to go in there for a swim. Hey, what does it mean? No bathing is permitted for make 30 a.m. Well, it's only five hours of having a wash. What does that mean? Like, oh, because oh, you can't ever... They don't even know how to hop in there. Um, kia ora el ngafa, or the hot pool next to the bath shed, has been erupting a bit lately. Just be cautious around it, around then. So you should be careful in the... Well, so what does that mean, no bathing? So are you allowed to hop in there? Yeah, after five o'clock and before eight thirty, but before the tourists come in, pretty cool, eh? Yeah. Is, is it water warm? It's hot. It's hot. This, this water. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's quite hot. There. All right. This is a bit colder. Hmm. I reckon. Feel the ground too. Ground's Whoa. warm. Cool. <laughs> You can look into the ground, have a rest. What do you reckon? At least you know in the winter time if you, you could sleep oh, on the yeah, ground. Oh yeah, it'd be nice eh? So yeah, this, this water's quite warm. Actually, Whoa, actually um, really hot. It's actually really, really, really hot. So I would say those pools there will be really bloody hot. And it's a pure blister. No. You feel it. Is that hot? Was it? Feel it. Feel the actual bath, it's a bit cooler. Oh yeah. Oh that's nice. Oh nice but hot. Nice but really hot. Just walking up to the lake. Scotland. Scotland. Pretty huge, eh? Is that one? Yeah. Netherlands. Hey, who are you, Marika? Amnesia. 
Wow. That's all right. Especially on land here. Far out. Look at that Nevi. One, you're all right here. So look at that, everyone. Big lake of hot water. Nevi, come on. Come. Quick. Nevi, come on. Let's say fizz. I'll wait for you on the other side. Here she comes. Mm, I think someone's a bit scared of the, the trolls under the bridge or something under the bridge because um, the sandflies are attacking my daughter here and she's um, not having much fun so behind me you can see is Mount Tarawera the old volcano it erupted in 1886 right let's go shall we? let's go I'm getting bitten too through my pants so anyway I've got my new hat here my new cap, a new um, hunter's element. My other one was getting a bit old and stink and smelly, so uh, on the way here, I bought a new cap. Nath one for quite a while, and finally managed to pick one up. So, there you go. It's a bit muddy today, but so there are the rock paintings. Look, see. So how do they find them? Well, people at the time who were around 1886, or well, when it, they knew where they where they were, so it got re dug up again. So this is old paintings. These ones are old. Look like boats. What How have they even painted them? Blood? No, true, no blood. That would think it's some sort of um Oh here's a pepper tree. That's what a um what do you call it? 
Um, Kawakawa. Oh, that's beautiful. Kawakawa leaves. I think I'd rather just hop in the lake and wipe my bum in the lake. So this is it here. Yeah. Pretty wet, alright. Oh,